Okay, you rolling? Okay, we're gonna scare Jason with this spider. Come on, we're gonna get him back. Watch it! Guys, this is a film set, you gotta... Oh! Spider! Tons of things happen in our lives every day. And in a 24 hour period, we ask ourselves so many different questions. Like, what should I eat? What should I wear? Or who should I hang out with? Sometimes we ask bigger questions like, what do I wanna be when I grow up? Who will I marry? Or where will I live? But every once in a while, we ask ourselves those even bigger questions. Questions like, why am I here? What's my purpose? And is there more to life than this? The reality is, there aren't a lot of places we can go to explore life's biggest questions. So on Alpha, we want to create a space where we can talk about those kind of questions in a way that's open and honest. In each one of our hearts, it's like we have a happiness bucket that we're constantly trying to fill. It can sound like this. If I just had uh, more money or nicer clothes or a new girlfriend, then I'd be happy. The nights would come and the girls would be gone. Like, they'd be just me, you know, me and I guess God, right? And I'm like, okay, there's definitely more to life than this. Like, I just want, I want, I want, I want, and you don't get anything. There's this deeper, even spiritual hunger that we're all trying to satisfy. As someone who grew up in an atheistic home, I wasn't just gonna accept what he was gonna say. So I was like, okay, did this actually happen historically? What's the evidence? I'm not gonna just buy into something because I get swept up in the emotion of it. You have approximately 570,000 hours left to live. And we wanna invite you to spend less than 24 of them with us on Alpha. Hey everybody, Pastor Chad here. Hi, I'm Pastor Paul. How are you guys making out? One of the things that, uh, that we've been thinking about the last little while is, uh, man, this, this COVID stuff is just absolutely crazy. Like, it, it, it's really turned our world upside down. Um, it, it's created a lot of questions as to, you know, is this ever going to end? Um, it, it's, it's, it's even brought into, into thought and questioning, like, where is God uh, in the midst of all of this, and so uh, Paul and I, we've been we've been chatting with that, uh, chatting about that, and uh, so it, 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 it's kind of one of those things. Where is God in all of this? And so we want to answer that question. We want to we want to help other folks if, if they've been struggling with that question um, to answer that question. Because even in the midst of all of this, I think there are answers to this question. Paul, what, what do you think about about that question? Where is God? in the midst of, of, of even in, in all of this that's happening around our world right now? Chad, that's a good question. I'm sure there's a lot of people wondering where God is, you know? The truth is, God is right here. God is in the midst of all of this. You know, he promised that he would never leave us or forsake us. So we'd always be there. And you know, as we're working way through this virus, as through this um, uh, coronavirus, and as we struggle with, with this uh, social distancing and all the other things that we have to handle today, we know that God is here. He's here and He wants a relationship with us. He wants to let us know that He's here with us, that He'll help us through it. He'll guide us through these times of hardship, these times where, you know, the world itself seems to be mixed up and evil, all these funny things that are going on, that God is there and He can help us through that. And I think that uh, here at Hillsborough, for us doing Alpha at this time, is a good idea because Alpha has a wonderful way of showing us how to have a relationship with Jesus, how to deal with with times of suffering and difficulties. So yeah, we're gonna start this Alpha on Sunday, May the 3rd, seven o'clock. We're gonna set up the program and have it going online and we're hoping that many from our, commun our communities will be able to join with us. Yeah, God is here. Let's visit with him on Sunday night, May the 3rd. There you have it, folks. We are going to be doing Alpha starting May 3rd, Sunday at seven o'clock. Now the series that you're gonna see promoted, it's gonna say that it's Alpha Youth. And uh, I don't want that to, to sidetrack you. Uh, most adults that have gone through Alpha, when they saw the youth version of it, they thought that it was just better. They loved the creativity of it. They loved the way that it flowed and moved. And so you're gonna see some promotional stuff saying Alpha Youth, but that's we're still doing Alpha. We're gonna answer those questions, particularly in these difficult times, um, because everyone is wondering, where is God in the midst of this pandemic? So I hope that you will tune in. I hope you will join us online 
uh, you can log into hillsboroughbaptist.org and you will find all the info you need right there. Mark. <laughs> I don't even know how to put this thing on. Behind your ears. Behind <laughs> your ears! Alright, are we all good now? We are good to go. So are, are our feet like almost breaking the rules now? Like do we have to like oh, yeah. cross our leg the other? Maybe we yeah. should do the retake. Like, yeah. like, We're like good the... to go. Oh, oh. oh I'm, not, I'm <laughs> sorry. <laughs> other way or like what's... <laughs> Are, are we six feet yeah, apart? I, I, I think we're good. Yeah, I think we're good. I don't know. I think you're right. All right, are we all good now? We are good to go.